Well, this is week three of uh, spring practice for us. And uh, just like uh, you're in the middle of the season, this is kind of the, the grind part of it. And we got to continue to make sure we improve every single, every single opportunity we have to, to improve. And I think the guys have done an unbelievable job. I think we've had, you know, seven excellent practices and one so-so practice so far. Um, I am really pleased at our progress right now. We'll have one more day of installation. Uh, on Friday, and then we'll get ready for our Jersey scrimmage, which will be a long scrimmage for us, probably 120 plays. And we want to find out who can play when the red light goes on, who our tough guys are. And then we'll finish that last week. We'll have two Monday and Tuesday practice. We'll have a draft on Wednesday, practice on Thursday and Friday, and then finish up with the scrimmage on Saturday. So communication is vital. And that's something we preach every day. If you're not talking, if you're not, you know, communicating with the guy next to you, then everybody's going to be lost. So we want to say, hey, we want to communicate verbally, want to communicate with hand signals so we know what you're doing. And uh, they've, they've been doing a great job of utilizing that and, and, like you said, coming together as a whole and, and, and showing out there on the field that they can be productive. With practice and with repetitions comes togetherness and comes that they actually look like they know what they're doing. But, uh, you know, the thing I noticed, they're playing with a lot of energy. Guys like Andre Parker, you're throwing him in the fire, and C.J. Stewart, and Nick Conrad, and, and all those guys are all stepping up and, and really showing that, you know, hey, I can fill a lot of voids and I need to contribute this year. It's almost like it's a, um, I guess, nonverbal language that they can speak. You know, when you play with a guy, you know exactly where you where he's going to be. He knows exactly what you you're going to be, and then you start to see things the same. So then it becomes more of, instead of talking, you can kind of give them a look or you can give them a hand signal and they know it in a split second what's going on and what you're thinking. Better communication, you know, from the secondary to the linebacker to the D line, just put the puzzle together, you know, before the snap. And in that way, it helps us play faster and play, you know, less thinking and more reactionary. And that's, you know, that's the whole premise behind defense is knowing where my help is, knowing what the guy beside me is thinking. So when it happens, you know, we're there like, like a swarm. Watching our defense right now is they're understanding where their help is coming from. Uh, they're playing really good team defense and watching out for each other. If somebody misses a gap, the, the, the next line of support is, is showing up. Uh, they're running to the football better than they did the first week. Obviously, there's a lot of technical things that you can continue to improve upon, but uh, I, I really like their energy. Well, the, next, the next goal is, is to have a great Friday practice, and, but, but the jersey scrimmage on Saturday is huge, and, and we know that, and we want to win the blue jerseys, and, and that's the competitive side of the coaches and the players, and uh, we know that's what we've been working for. We had high expectations for the defense last year, and that hadn't changed. And so now these guys, they've experienced a little bit of success and now they want to build on it. They're holding each other accountable and it's starting to show up on the field. Last year, everybody was learning it for the first time. Now it's like old hat and old habits with comfortability brings confidence and continuity brings more added production. It makes defense, coaching defense really fun when those guys are just you know, you get it hat one word out and they already know what the defensive call is and they can just go. So it's it's fun. It's fun coaching.